The author J.K. Rowling, famous for her Harry Potter novels, has recently moved to the Aberfeldy area. Indeed, in this deep, craggy forest of Weem, there are legends of dragons and demons that haunt the caves and cliffs. Mystery also surrounds the purchase by the Scottish Knights Templar in the 1990s of a disused church nearby as the rumoured sanctuary of the Stone of Destiny, or Stone of Schoon, which was stolen from Westminster Abbey on Christmas Eve 1950. Some say it was a copy that was duly returned two months later. Certainly a stone turned up in Parliament Square, Edinburgh in 1965 and was given into the care of the Reverend William Nimmo and kept at St Columba's Church in Dundee, which was closed in 1990. And that stone was supposedly moved hereabouts. Arriving at a junction, the main road passes over the Aberfeldy Bridge into the town. However, we follow the minor road and head east. And after a few miles, you'll see the signs for Clooney House Gardens, a six-acre Himalayan woodland garden and home to the country's widest tree, one of two giant sequoias planted in the mid-19th century. You reach the pretty hamlet of Grantley, with its imposing and private castle. Nearby, a short distance west and a mile off the main road to Aberfeldy, past Grantley Castle, is St Mary's Chapel, built in 1533 by Sir William Stuart, the Laird of Grantley and Sheriff Principal of Perth, and extended in 1636 with a magnificent painted ceiling. It became the parish church in 1883 and closed nine years later. It's open to the public, with access up a farm road leading to a car park.